Welcome to IC3D training video correcting carton fold templates. This carton templates tutorial will show how to correct die lines that are incorrect or are incomplete. This example shows a structure that has some fold lines missing, and there are other issues that need to be corrected before we can create a model. You should always begin by splitting all the lines using the split lines button. Using the Select Point tool, click and drag across the structure or select Ctrl-A on the keyboard to select all the lines. Click on the Cuts tool in the toolbar to make the lines cut, shown in green. Then holding the keyboard Shift key, select all the middle lines in the structure so that these can be changed to folds. If you accidentally select a cut line, then this can be deselected by using the Alt key and clicking on the line to be deselected. Once all the required lines have been selected, click on the Folds button in the toolbar to change them to Folds, shown in red. Next, select the Generate Model button. An error message shows, indicating that one of the folds appears to have more than one line and that the lines are not collinear. We need to break apart the fold before proceeding. Select OK and the editor displays the problem area in yellow. Select a cut line to remove this and then select the fold. It is clear that two folds are joined together. Break these apart using the Break Apart Selected Lines button in the toolbar. They then become individual lines. To check if the fold lines are joined properly, zoom in on the corner and you can immediately see that there is a gap between the faces. Select the Edit and Move Points Mode button in the toolbar to reveal anchor points between the two faces. These anchors can be clicked and moved freely. Or if you hold down the S key and click and drag the anchor, it will cleanly snap on to the next anchor point to join the faces. Click on the Fit to Screen button on the toolbar to view the entire structure again. Select the Generate Model button and the flat cutout structure shows in the preview. The green eye icon shows the face that will show at the front when added to the 3D view. This can be changed using the Change Faces button in the toolbar if required. The structure still clearly shows that there are some fold lines missing in the editor. We can add these by selecting the Add Lines button. Click and drag the line to the selected fold area. This can be done freely, or if you hold down the Shift key, the line will draw either vertically straight or horizontally straight. Click on the end of the line once drawn. It is best to draw across the lines you wish to join as shown. Repeat the process with the other missing line. Ensure you click on the end of the line once it is drawn. Select the Split Lines button and you will see that the trailing lines from your added lines are now separate. These can be deleted using the Delete Lines button. The remaining lines can then be changed to folds. Select the Generate Model button and the corrected model appears in the preview. If you now select the Control F buttons on the keyboard, all the folds will be selected as multiples. In the Angle field, configure an angle of 90 degrees, and the folded carton will show in the preview. Add model to the scene, and the corrected and folded carton appears in the 3D view. This completes the IC3D training video correcting carton fold templates.